Um, yeah, I don't anticipate being ahead of George in qualifying, particularly in this year. Um, but uh, something fishy is going on in Mercedes, according to Lewis Hamilton, following an uneventful Monaco Grand Prix. Hamilton finished 7th and teammate George Russell finished 5th after fending off Verstappen in the later stages of the race. But comments from Lewis left everyone questioning the team's strategy. Lewis said, Once we got qualifying, I don't understand. I already know automatically that I'm going to lose two tenths going into qualifying, he added, that he won't be able to out-qualify Russell for the rest of the year. But let's investigate this claim by Hamilton. How does Lewis know, he will lose two tenths in qualifying? Has he been doing the math? In Monaco from FP1 to FP3, Hamilton was ahead of Russell by two-tenths on average in all sessions but come qualifying, George was ahead by 700th to Lewis. When looking at the times from other teams whoever was ahead in these three sessions, FP1 to FP3 qualified ahead of their teammate. Leclerc was ahead in all sessions and ahead in qualifying, Piastri was ahead in two sessions and qualified ahead of Lando, Verstappen was ahead in all sessions and qualified ahead of Perez, but in Lewis's case it was different. Hamilton was ahead in all sessions and qualified behind George Russell which doesn't add up. Why does Lewis think he loses 2 tenths automatically going in qualifying, does the team reduce his car's power output relative to Russell during qualifying? Is that what Hamilton is trying to say but in different words? Lewis could have finished 6th had Mercedes told him to push on his outlap, after pitting on lap 51, to undercut Verstappen but his race engineer told him to do a normal outlap, instead of outlap critical like they normally do to undercut their opponent. So this is out like normal, but uh, that time should just come to you. That hard to push. Yeah, just push. Yeah. It's like the Suzuki. Why didn't you tell me that? That was pretty cool. That also raised some issues of favoritism in the team when George run the only upgraded wing. But it's natural Russell will be given priority given he's staying with the team next year.